Hey, over here. No, over here. Just follow my voice. Hi, I'm Alex. I know, it's a little strange, a talking honeybee. But I have something really special to show you. Unfortunately, I can't show you at your current size. So hold on, this might tingle a little. Now you can see the world the way I do. Come on, let's fly. You know what you're watching this in? B-R. <laughs> you know what most people don't realize about us honeybees? We do a lot more than just make honey, and our way of life is being threatened. Follow me. This is where my friends and I live and work. Everyone is busy pollinating. These are almond trees. Without us bees and pollinators, they wouldn't produce almonds. In fact, our simple pollination accounts for an extraordinary one-third of the world's food. Our handiwork gives life to everything from almonds to avocados to strawberries. But something terrible is happening. The farms where we live are only growing one type of food. And when their bloom ends, our food, our homes, and our way of life go with it. In the last few years, we have lost a devastating amount of our colonies. Without diverse flowering crops, we won't survive. And without bees, the whole world will change. Plants, animals, and the Earth's entire ecosystem would drastically be altered. We may be small, but we play a major role in your world. You have to help us. Then, together, we can reverse what's happening. All it takes is a little extra effort from all of us. Bee-friendly companies that grow biodiverse plants help give us a constant source of food and a year-round habitat. You can do the same at home if you plant native wildflowers like lavender and lilac. These simple steps can help make an extraordinary difference that might just save the world. Now, I am counting on you to tell everyone about our struggle and how simple it is to help us. I'll see you around. Bye.